and welcome to Let's Play with Creative Arts Theater, the City of Tampa's professional theater for young audiences. My name's Meg, and today we're going to be playing the Story Ball Game. At Creative Arts, we often work as a team to write our plays. In The Magic Fish, multiple people worked with the playwright to create the story, and it was better than if only one person's creative voice had been used. In this game, we tell a story as a team, all while thinking on our feet. It's very important to listen and follow along with what the other players are adding to the story. So how do you play? Great question. The person telling their part of the story has the invisible story ball. Oh, hold on, I'll go get it. Here's the ball, do you see it? The person who has the ball will start the story with once upon a time. Once they've said a few sentences, they will pass the ball to the next person and that person will add to the story. Once they are done, they will pass it to the next person and so on and so forth. It's very important to honor and respect whatever our friends and family add to the story. Simply go with whatever they give you when your turn comes and do your best to make the story make sense. Let's give it a try with some of my family. This is my nephew Noah. This is my niece Natalie. And this is Grandma. Let's play Story Ball! Once upon a time, there was a little girl who moved to a new town. She was very nervous about making new friends. She felt all alone. Every day she would go to school and would sit by herself at lunch. She was too shy to ask to sit with any of the other kids. Everyone thought that she was weird because the only time she spoke was when she was called on in class. Because of that, she was very sad. Her parents worried about her. They didn't know what to do until an alien ship landed just outside of the town. Grandma, it has to make sense. Hush, child, I know what I'm doing. Everyone was afraid of the aliens. The aliens meant no harm. They just wanted to make friends on this new planet. But every time they got too close to one of the humans, the humans would run away screaming in fear like this. The shy girl watched the aliens from a distance and saw that they were nice. One day she felt very brave and she approached them. Hi, she said. The aliens smiled at her and said hi back. The girl ran back to her house. The aliens are nice, she shouted. We don't need to be afraid. She went to the mayor and explained what happened. The mayor decided to meet with the aliens and make peace. The little girl helped her restore order to the town. Everyone loved her and wanted to sit with her at lunch. She agreed and made lots of new friends, both human and alien. She went on to become an astronaut and an alien expert changing the way the whole world views extraterrestrial life. The end. Now it's your turn to give it a try. You can play the story ball game at home with your entire family or at a safe distance with your friends. Use your imaginations and work together as a team to tell a complete story. Who knows what you'll come up with? The sky's the limit. Thank you for playing with me today. Join us again soon for another installment of Let's Play with Creative Arts Theater. And remember, stay calm, stay kind, 
Stay safe and always stay creative.